Hello and welcome to my channel Green Lion Goddess Tarot. This is your daily reading for June the 3rd, 2021. Justice has just come out. I do apologize. I'm having a bit of an up and down week this week. So I kind of missed yesterday as well. Just energy levels really, I don't know. I think I'm finding something off. So, or either it's energetic, but anyway, I don't want to go on about it too much because we have the Queen of Pentacles coming out. Health, looking after yourself, daily routines, reworking and rebalancing some daily routines. And we've certainly seen this coming through. And with this um, energy at the moment, it is a lot to do with uh you know, wanting personal freedom, but up against social or some sort of limitation coming through here. And uh, seven of pentacles growth. So it's kind of like this interesting oppositional energy. Oh, the nine of pentacles. This is nice energy coming through. Look at all these pentacles growing and the sun, a breakthrough. Wow. Okay. So good energy for today, I would say. And the three of pentacles. Nice. So, wow, okay, I do feel like, you know, it starts with this justice card, which is a new contract or a rebalancing of some sort in some kind of relationship to self or relationship to others, and it can be relationship to money as well. But we're seeing when we move into the Queen of Pentacles, this is that energy I was talking about, is she's the nurturer. She looks after her money. She looks after her health. She cares for herself. She cares for other people. And that's the energy we're seeing, that if you put the time and the effort in to really care and nurture for something and really sit and think about where you want to put your time and your energy, where you want to invest that, uh, there is this sense of some kind of uh, breakthrough coming in in terms of freedom, in terms of independence, in terms of uh, even financial independence coming through. I mean, we're seeing a lot of fi a lot of growth here suddenly from the Queen to the Seven of Nine. It's sort of like the effort you put in will be rewarded, uh, and there will be happiness and breakthroughs, rebalancing. There will be a greater sense of worth, self worth, perhaps more money coming in. So it's really. Yeah, just saying it's really, I feel like the key is really this Queen of Pentacles. It's this beautiful Capricorn energy and it really is saying, look at what your needs are, your personal needs in terms of your health, in terms of what you, the money you need, uh, in terms of your resources, what resources do you need to help all of that? And in invest, it's the day of looking at that and working out where you can invest some positive energy and time into that uh, to see this growth and to see this breakthrough and to see this sense of feeling like things are working again. So, you know, with the Three of Pentacles, it is around showcasing skills and abilities and also, you know, feeling like with sitting right next to the justice card, it, it can feel like things start to flow within a group energy that there is everybody's pulling their weight. And that could have been part of what's happening here with the justice and the three of pentacles is something to do with group dynamics and how they're flowing and bringing in some kind of new arrangement with yourself or with I do feel like it's with yourself. It's like starts with you. It's like, what do I want from this? Uh, what am I going to be bringing in? How am I going to invest my time and energy in these things? So in group projects or where, I, where I'm contributing to the world or where I'm feeling like I'm adding value to a situation or, you know, those sort of things are coming through. And that's where the justice can be new contracts. It can be a new soul contracts or a new contract with yourself. So this could be making a commitment to self to look after, uh, to really change the way you're, you're, you're working with your money or change the way that you're working with your health and to really look at some of those. The, the Queen of Pentacles is around daily routines as well, you know, how you're, how they're working for you and, Really, you know, with that sun card coming in, it brings a lot of the sun shines uh, and brings a lot of clarity over a lot of these issues. And so that's why it has the opportunity to bring breakthroughs 
and new opportunities and happiness because of that. And so what you do with that information is entirely up to you as it is, but it's a day for a lot of uh making some decisions or around positive movement forward in terms of those areas. And it's saying that there is a lot of good stuff that could come out of this. It really is. A lot of the energy at the moment is showing you a lot of uh, different ways and uh, presenting a sense of, again, we can see the nine of pentacles is the freedom. The justice card is where you've, uh, you know, signed the contract and said, I'm going to do this. So this could be work versus your health, career versus play kind of thing. So it could be looking at all of those things, but I do feel like uh, you're looking at trying to find the balance between the two and nurturing uh, the your most basic needs that you and physical needs. And when I say that, it's not just... You know, this can be, it's not just career, money, health. It's like what physically, what else do you need? What resources do you need? How do you want to feel valued in the world? How do you want to feel like no stress around money? It's all those sort of things. So, uh, yeah, I do feel like there's a lot of reworking, revisiting. It's all those rewords that are coming in. But, uh, yeah, ultimately I think it comes back to yourself and deciding what's best for you. So, yeah, I mean, it's really positive energy and I, but I do feel like I'm just, I'm kind of getting this more of an, on an intuitive sense. I feel like there's this energy kind of pushing and resisting this. It's like you're kind of almost working against the tide. It's like, I have to come back in and do this, but it's not, even though it looks like it's flowing easily, I'm not getting that necessarily energetically with the reading intuitively. It feels like, yes, this is becoming something that's become a focus and importance for the day, but it does feel like there's something you're pushing against or some sort of force that is resisting or making it a bit harder. So you have to work equally hard, even more hard and put in the effort with this. So <laughs> that's the energy for the day. And uh, I hope that you all do well with this. So look forward to seeing you tomorrow, hopefully, and take care. Bye.